So y'all, we just got done with a photography session. My boy Fru behind the camera. Yeah. Doing his thing. Y'all, the hardest thing every single day is literally preparing your mind for the grind. Mm. You know, you don't know how you gonna shine. You just know that you gotta get up and make something happen. So right. uh, something that somebody said to me yesterday that was so important, I was at a entrepreneurship uh, event. Mm -hmm. And something important that somebody told me was, I said, so how do you, how did you become an entrepreneur? Like, when did you take that step? Right. He said he had no business plan, no marketing plan. He just had the faith to create something every single day. And mm. as it rolled out, he was able to um, eliminate the doubt and just go after it. Mm. Like, why are you sitting around waiting on permission? God is just waiting on you to follow your intuition, to follow his mission. You don't need permission for anything. Mm. Like, you are attached to nobody or nothing. Like, you have all the creative freedom in the world to create, be, and do, and see anything that you want. Mm. And once I realized that, I was like, oh shoot! It's a game changer, it's isn't game, it? It's a game the game! Mm -hmm. So every single day, I've just been connecting with people. The more that you talk to people and tell them about your vision and, and see how you can add value to people's lives, that's how you thrive. Mm. Like, I am putting myself in a position I don't need to take. I need to go give. What mm. can I give? Think about that. You really start to live when you think about what can you give. Stop thinking about what you can get because it's not about you. Ooh. It's about glorifying Christ mm -hmm. and living your best life. And you Amen. can live your best life when you start with giving. Don't start with you because if you start with you, you're going to quit. <laughs> I said, you know what? Go low so God can go high. And I don't mean humble yourself as in dimming your light. I mean that we're all meant to shine bright, but it takes a person with humility to realize I didn't, I, I'm not already there yet. I didn't make it yet. Mm. So now that I understand I, I haven't made it yet and there's still a lot more work to do, right. I'm going to put in the work. Put it right? In. Put I'm it going in. to fight. I am going to not give up. I'm going to make a way when there's no way. I'm going to communicate with people. Mm. Right? Okay, let me ask you this then. What would you say to somebody that's struggling right now that doesn't know what to do um, career-wise or really mm. what their gift is in the world. That's, that's a really good, good one. If you don't know what your gift is, go back to when you were a child. What was that thing that you did that came so naturally? What was that thing that you did that you do the most naturally when nobody else is watching you? Mm. That's the thing that you need to start to dig into and start to use, right? Mm -hmm. I don't want you to, don't get conformed in what the social norm is of going to school and trying to figure that out in a major. College is a great platform to try numerous amounts of things. So use that as your platform to perform that gift that you have. Right. If you are very good at braiding hair, girl, you better start braiding hair. If you're really good at doing someone's makeup, do somebody's makeup. If you're very good at doing photos, do that. Use use your college platform as, a, as an opportunity to perform. I mean, that's what I did. Mm -hmm. I started to take pictures and create videos when I was in college and now it's put me in such a space where now I, I, I really love to tell stories. And so that's kind of what I like to do every single day right. right right and so i wouldn't say one thing your gift will not come from the world your gift comes from god and it is inside of you and so i would really encourage you don't pretend to be something that you're not because god can't bless that person he can't bless who you pretend to be if you show up as yourself you show up in in your truth then you're able to navigate and figure out what it is that you're called to do and be comfortable in that the worst thing that you can do is try to be something that you're not. Like, I love Oprah to death, but I'm not gonna show up and try to be Oprah. I'm gonna right. show up and be Chloe, mm -hmm. right? I know you got inspirations. I know there is a lot of things that, cool things that people are doing that are on another level, but the best thing that you can do is show up as you. Mm. And people will appreciate that. People Amen. don't appreciate when you faking. Right. <laughs> and like, there was only so long that I could show up speaking what Oprah said. <laughs> you right. know, I had to show up as Chloe. Dang, so just good. just be yourself. Mm. Period. 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 Be, be yourself. Be, be yourself. yourself. Good. Yeah. Good. Good.